In this video, we will show you how to install the Lime 3DS emulator on Android, the best Nintendo 3DS emulator for Android smartphone. Gamers from the late 90s are familiar with the Nintendo 3DS console. It was a portable, foldable game console with phenomenal memories that would last for your entire life. Although the Nintendo 3DS is no longer in production, but you can still play its games on an Android phone you using the LAMP 3DS. Today's video is our step-by-step -step tutorial and in this video we are going to cover how to install the LAMP 3DS emulator, initial setup guide, the best configuration and settings and then how to install games on the LAMP 3DS at the last gaming experience. After watching this video, your Android device will be turned into a Nintendo 3DS console. Please like and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the bell button. What's up guys, this is Pro Warriors. First, let me introduce Lime, an emulator for Android that enables you to run and play your favorite hybrid console games like Nintendo 3DS on your smartphone. The Lime 3DS provides a completely free service so that you can enjoy your favorite Nintendo 3DS games without the need for a high-end device. The first thing we are going to do is download and install Lime 3DS on our Android phone. Unfortunately, is not available on the google play store you can download this application from the github page i will drop the link in the description on the github page of lime 3ds we can see a warning the current alpha version is pre-released so it could contain some issues and very soon the stable version will be released then just download the following app it's a small application it will download within a few seconds once you have downloaded the apk we will install the application after installation done let's go ahead had launched Lime 3DS. First of all, Lemonade will welcome us, then click on Get Started button. Then we had to grant permission to allow notification from Lime 3DS, the same way we have to grant permission for microphone and camera. Then it will say to select a folder where it will store data. So click on the Select button and it will open your file manager. Here we have to create a folder and then give a name like Lemonade. Click on Use this folder and Lime 3DS to use the storage. Now they will ask you to select the folder where you have stored the Nintendo 3DS games. So we have to identify the games folder which Lime will automatically detect and show games in the game library. Click on add games button here inside the Lime 3DS folder create a new folder then tap on use this folder which is at the bottom and it will allow Lemona to have access to this folder. Now tap on the next button. We can see the system has all already set the primary configuration click on the continue button guys before we are going to add games on lamp emulator let's configure settings because it's really matter to the gaming performance click on the three dot which is at the bottom right corner then open settings open the general option i suggest you to turn off the limit speed option to use the maximum resources under the option of system you can set region language and clock unfortunately this application has not given us any access to customize gamepad but default gamepad is okay in the graphics option you can set the graphics api to opengl or vulcan opengl belongs to snapdragon and vulcan for mali or other chipset but i suggest you to use both api to find out the best one for you here you can also customize the internal resolution up to 4k i suggest you to use the native display resolution because higher resolution demand higher configuration of your device there are tons of other options but i I would like to touch them today come back to the main settings here you can see another important option custom gpu driver unfortunately only snapdragon chipset can install custom gpu driver it actually help you to run big games but my one is mali so i can't install any custom gpu driver now let's install games on Lemonade emulator. You can see I have already downloaded Nintendo 3DS games. Wait a minute. Now you might be wondering why I get these games and which games we should download. Guys, it's very simple. Select a game, then open the Chrome browser, then write 3DS ROM. 3DS is the game format. I think now you can easily download games. There are several sources for that. I'm not going to give you any direct link here because it will be against the YouTube community guidelines. Please join 
find our discord server for more information after downloading the file make sure you have unzipped the file and move the game file to the games folder so guys let's launch a game and see how blind 3ds run nintendo 3ds games on android phone just to tap on the game you would like to play immediately it will start running if you want to rotate the screen at the sidebar you got option for rotate screen if you want to save game history you can use the save state option another option of overlay you can add it and resize control keys and show fps you can also swap a screen cheats and many more options there if the gaming experience is so good that you will stop playing on your nintendo switch even you have it please like and subscribe to our channel and join our discord server for any type of help see you in the next video take care